Hey everyone, I wanted to share with you today a bit of wisdom that I've attained in my 30 years on earth, 18 years as a musician, and 10 years as a producer. We as artists and musicians who want to get our music out into the world for people to hear need to have a conversation about quality over quantity. As a mixing engineer, I often get quote requests from artists and bands who self-produce and have massive visions for very large projects. They've spent a lot of money and a lot of hours to get the equipment and knowledge necessary to produce their own music from their own environment in which they're comfortable, one that is conducive to their unique individual creative process. Over the last seven months, their band has written and recorded 14 great songs that now they want to have them mixed and mastered to a professional standard. When that initial conversation turns into a project quote delivered to their email inbox, they're afraid of the number that they see. It's beyond the budget restrictions that exist for the project they've been dreaming of and working towards for the last half year. They hyperfixate on the quantity of songs to be released rather than the quality of songs to be released. So they settle for okay mixes on their great songs and they only outsource for mastering. They think that a proper master will save a song on which the mix is less than ideal, but it doesn't, it can't. An okay, an okay mix will take a great song and make it an okay song, no matter who masters it. They now have a full-length album, but it sounds bland, lifeless, dull, and static. When I say static, I mean lacking a sense of movement or motion. The goal of mixing isn't purely scientific or analytical in nature. Yes, there is a degree of mixing that involves basic understanding of the physics of sound and a knowledge of how different sounds interact with one another and how they interact with the tools that we use to process them. What I'm about to say next is something that I've heard many people say. I've read it in books, and I've seen it in instructional content that I have paid for so that I can continue to learn and grow as a mixer. The true goal of mixing is to take a collection of tracks and turn them into something that makes an emotional impact on a listener. Something that moves, breathes, and vibrantly pops out of the speakers with a sense of life and purpose. A good mix is something that is as unique as each project. Between inspiration drawn from the combination of the song itself and the wants, needs, and goals of the artist. It is something built from the ground up by someone who has spent years training to use their ears, their tools, and their judgment to highlight the things that make a song special. A proper master is and can only be an extension of a good mix. Mastering is a light-handed process, not a band-aid to cover the lack of a good mix. When we settle for quantity over quality, unfortunately we end up with big projects that people might listen to one time, and then they move on from it because they are not moved by it. A good song alone isn't enough to keep a listener engaged. It has to sound good and to, and to connect with them as well. I work with some artists regularly who will only put out one to two songs or maybe an EP over the course of any given year. Their focus lies solely on checking all the boxes for quality release, and these are the people who wind up with great finished products. Songs that make an emotional impact and build a genuine connection with a listener. And these songs keep the listener interested. They come back to it repeatedly until the next one releases. The core point of my saying all this is to convey to you that having one to four great songs with great mixes that make a great connection with the listener will be something that sets you and your band apart from the rest of the pack. It will always win over having a massive release that people won't want to come back to. When you place your focus on quality over quantity, your listeners will keep coming back because every time they do, they'll discover something new in the sonic journey that happens when they listen to your music. Choose quality over quantity for your next release. Thank you. Have a great one.